All right, learning plan 4A. You have a discussion board post again for this learning plan. And then there's a couple other assignments. There's no reflection entry for this learning plan. Um, but there are a couple of five-point assignments that you're going to be doing. And one of them is called Change Talk. There are two handouts. The PDF looks like this. And this just go, reviews Change Talk that you've already uh, read about in your text. This is just more of a helpful way of, I think at least, organizing the information in that chapter a little bit. So there's that handout. And, but all you're going to be submitting is a change talk um, that DLC, which is right here. <clears throat> Let's pull that up here. Right here. And so all you're going to do, each statement contains a change talk and sustain talk portion. So you're just going to write a simple or complex reflection next to the statement to reflect the change talk. All right, so you're going to open this up, you're going to write your reflection, save it, and then you're going to upload it to Blackboard. All right, so that's that assignment. The next one is called Change Talk versus Sustain Talk. You're going to review the statements and identify which ones are considered Change Talk and which ones are considered Sustain Talk. And the ones that are considered sustain talk, you're going to also you're going to um, indicate what level of commitment the client is exhibiting. So you're going to use a darn C approach, or in the text, it's darn cat desire, abilities, reasons, need, commitment, action, and taking steps. All right, so you'll be identifying which ones are change talk and which ones sustain talk and then for the change talk statements only you're going to identify where on the continuum using darn cat is the client all right so this one's worth five points this one's worth five points discussion board is worth 10 so you have a total of 20 points for this learning plan all right, as usual, if you have any questions, give me a call, email me, or you can post your questions in the Q&A section of the discussion board section. See you in the next learning plan.